Welcome back to Top Hookah. We're back for Mixology Monday. I'm Straight Mint John. And I'm Mix Master Mike. Last week we couldn't do Mixology Monday. I blew up my car. That was a long three day process. But we're back and we're better than ever. So, Mike, I'm going to tell them what I mixed up first. I mixed up strawberry with some blueberry with mint and vanilla. Oh my mm -mm. god. Mm -mm -mm. Mike, mm -mm. what did you mix up? And we'll get in back to like the review of it. I mixed up some guava. Oh my god. Melon. Oh my god. And mango madness. Oh my god. Special edition. Amazing. We're on the special edition kick. It's the latest Alfalker line out. It's awesome. They have a lot of awesome flavors in their special edition. Make sure you guys check out our Instagram, our Facebook. Leave a link down in the description. We're going to have giveaways, contests for some Al Fokker Special Edition, some 50 grams, some other exciting Maybe a t-shirt, maybe, uh, maybe another apple after. on top, some mm. more flavor. But before we get into this, I want to congratulate Zach Rise, or Re Reese, or whatever it goes by. I am the Nordic, Nordic Nightmare. Nightmare. He's a part of the hookah enthusiast. He joined our contest. I've spoke with him already. He's very grateful and thankful for what he won, and we're very grateful to be able to give you guys something back because without you guys, there's no top hookah. So definitely congratulations, buddy. We're so excited. We're going to send your package out tomorrow. You should have it by the end of the week, maybe the start of next week. And uh, we hope maybe you uh, share some pictures of what you want, maybe a little video or something like that. But let's get back to this Mixology Monday. Strawberry, Ooh. blueberry with mint and vanilla. What am I tasting? Let's take some rips. Let's smoke these hookahs. So, I got some Medwalk cubes on mine. And Mike's got four titanium flats. So, my flavor, honestly, um, I didn't do any ratios. I did what I thought would be good. So, I, would, I put more vanilla with a little bit of blueberry and a little bit more strawberry. And what I'm tasting right now is a creamy strawberry and blueberry type of cake. It tastes like straight blueberry strawberry cake. It is amazing. I love it. It's very smooth. It's a different world than what Mike's messing with right now. Mike's got that sweet tone to it. We'll get into his in a little bit. Mine's got that rich creaminess vibe to it. And you're getting a nice hint of strawberry and blueberry. It's not overpowering. It's very smooth and subtle flavor. It's nothing over the top. This is something that you would smoke in the morning, maybe after dinner with for a dessert or something. Along the lines, that's something that you would get into. But honestly, I would recommend this mix. It is amazing. It has been mixed up by your own Straight Mint John from Top Hookah. So, Mix Master Mike, let's talk about what you're working with. So guys, I put mostly guava and mango madness in this with a little bit of melon. I put the melon in there just to sweeten it up. I put the guava in... Mango Madness for that nice citrusy, fruity flavor. These flavors mix together so, so well. I know John's a big fan of guava, so he's going to really enjoy this mix. But, this mix is really, really in your face. So if you're not into really flavorful mixes, I wouldn't recommend this. But if you love in your face over-the-top flavors where it's just going to be so powerful in your mouth that you're just going to be like, oh my god, this is so, so good. Shooting Mixology Monday. Get John's ready, taking guys. a little Instagram video while we're shooting this video. But back to the mix. This is a very, it's actually really smooth it, and the sweetness of the melon really, really makes this mix even better. So if you're into citrusy, fruity mixes, if you like guava, if you like melon, if you like mango, definitely try this. I want to try John's mix because I helped him out with it. He helped me out with mine a little bit. So John, let's do a little bit definitely. of a switch up. Yeah, definitely. I gotta hit this. Mm. 
may be a little bit hot because of all this heat I put to my bowl, but I love hot hoopers. Well, you already know I can take the heat, so I ain't even worried about it. Honestly, right off the bat, from tasting this flavor, I could taste the guava, and I am a huge fan of guava. I love guava. If you haven't tried it, I suggest you try the new box. The old box is a little bit weird, but the new box is really sweet, and it's got this candy flavor. Um, you get the you get the melon right after the guava. I swear, like you could taste the guava coming in. Then about halfway of the draw, you're tasting the melon, which is really good, and then you're getting the mango madness. I swear, this is a great mix. Honestly, yeah, this is really like citrusy too. So the so the melon probably really toned down that citrusness. Definitely, definitely. It's very smooth, actually. I thought it was going to be really strong, but it's actually really smooth. It kind of tastes like a fruity gum. Mm, a guava. Like a trident. Some type of trident. <coughs> guava melon gum. The mango is making it very smooth. Without the mango, um, it'd be very sweet. So the mango is really dulling it down. But honestly, it's very, it's very good. Oh my god, honestly. It's actually giving me a buzz. I haven't had one of those in years. <laughs> it's our first hookah, well, my first hookah of the day. But we just got together for this contest giveaway. We're so excited. We can't wait to do more of them. But, uh, Mike, honestly, out of 10, I'm giving this a 9. It's a 9 oh. out of 10. It, it's... It's strong, and I can tell you that this is probably going to go another round of Coles. It's very strong. He's got the Goodfella V2 packed up, and I got this funnel bowl similar to the Goodfella. It's a little bit bigger. But, um... John, I have to say... Clouds. This mix that you came up with... Oh my god. I might not give this hose back. Don't even ever. give me all the credit, bro, because we were picking out mixes, and I knew I wanted to mix. I was going to mix strawberry blueberry with Al Fokker Special Edition 7 Wings, but Mike's like, dude, mix vanilla with strawberry and blueberry. So a lot of the credit's going to go to Mike for this. We were on the same page because we had the same taste, but I mean, big shout out to Mike. Um, he's the mix master. It's, it's what he does. I mean... I'm I'm a straightforward type of guy. Um, he's very he's a mix master. I mean, he's got mixes on deck. He's very good at making things go well together. So honestly, both of these hookahs are great. Definitely recommended you try this. Um, we're gonna leave a link to a description to Al Fokker's Facebook, Instagram. We'll do ours as well. Make sure you stay tuned to our Instagram page because we're going to do more giveaways. We might even do smaller giveaways for just a couple flavors or something. Um, we could definitely use some artwork. So we're thinking about running an artwork contest. Maybe you uh, uh, design us a logo. Something, something with for a t-shirt, a banner, even maybe even an intro. If you guys are into any of that, this will... Fit you perfectly because we are looking for some new artwork. Even if it's just maybe, maybe you're really good at sketching. Maybe if you sketched us our picture where our, I got the O in front of my hand and Mike's blowing a cloud or... Um, just draw something up and then we'll put it on a t-shirt. Anything hookah related, make sure Top Hookah is involved on there. Yeah. And if you want, add a little Al Fokker thing in there too because that's our thing. We love Al Fokker. They love us just as much as we love them. So maybe include them in there too. And maybe we might be able to do a little join um, giveaway or something. But um, I want to get into this mix a little bit more because <laughs> this, this is so good. It's starting I to want you up. guys to know how good this is. I used to mix blueberry and vanilla all the time with a little bit of coconut and it tastes like some blueberry cake. So that's where I really got the idea to put vanilla in the blueberry and strawberry. And it tastes like a berry cake. You get the strawberry and the blueberries in the background, but that vanilla, it, the vanilla really tastes like cake. Straight up vanilla cake all the way. And the blueberry and strawberry, just it's like a cupcake or just cake in general. It's so good, the fruitiness and the smoothness of this mix just go together so well. If you guys have any 
any questions on what to mix with any flavor, I could help you out. I love to mix. Every hookah I pack, I'm pretty much mixing a flavor. I love to mix flavors. I know even if a flavor isn't the best to me, I know I can make it better. So if you guys have flavors that you'd like to enjoy a little bit more, let me know. Let me know what flavors you have and I'll give you some awesome mixes. But guys, I think it's about time we wrap up this video. We want you guys to be interactive with us on our Instagram and Facebook because we're going to have awesome giveaways like we said. And one last thing before we go, do you even out, fuckers?